Hello, welcome back to my channel, Stream and Go. In this video tutorial, we're going to be showing you how to install the application Aurora Google Play Store. And Aurora, Aurora Google Play Store is an application made up of many apps. Now, before we get started, you will need to download the app and the filing app. Now, if you don't have that, please look at my previous video and it will show you how to install it. Now, before we get started, please like and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell to receive my weekly videos. That being said, let's get started. Now, we're going to go ahead and go into the filing app. So we just go down upon your app and channels. We'll see where it says see all. We'll click on it. And this brings up all the apps that you have installed and also some pre-installed apps. But we want to find file link. So we just go down to see file link. And we have it right there. It says file link. Click on file link. I'm going to put in my store code. So we want to click on it to enter the code. And the code is 8933. Four, five, eight, eight. It's eight nine three three four five eight eight. And once we have my store code in, we want to go down, highlight next, and click next. We want to click continue. Now this is my store right here. Now we're going to just give it a couple of seconds to dismiss this message that's going to come up. And there's the message. Once you see this message, just just go over to this mess and just want to click it. Now, before we install the Aurora Google Play Store, we want to install the mouse toggle. Now, the mouse toggle is what you're going to need to navigate through this application. So, we want to go down until we find mouse toggle. And there you have it right there, mouse toggle. Now, once we see mouse toggle, make sure we highlight it and we want to click it to start the download. And once the download is finished, and to know that it is finished, you will see the play icon at the end. So once you see that play icon at the end, it's ready to be clicked again to start the installation process. So we want to go down and over to highlight install. Once we got install highlighted, we click on it. Now it's ready to open. So we go down and over, highlight open and click on it. And you see the mouse target app comes up. And you're going to see this little message come up. There we go. Now once this message comes up, we just want to click on it. Always allow. And we just go down and click OK. So once we click OK, now this is... This is how you know your mouse toggle is working. Always look down at the bottom in your, in your corner of your TV where it says status. It must say started. If it don't say anything, it's not ready to be used. It normally takes about a second or two. It was already, it has came up, it had already came up while we was waiting on that message to come up to allow. But once it says started, you know it's ready to be used. So now what we want to do, hit the back button, go back to my Play Store, now we want to find the application Aurora Google Play Store. So we'll just go up to find Aurora. There we go. Now, once we see Aurora, we want to highlight it and click on it to start the download process. Again, once you see that play icon, it's ready to be clicked again, so we'll click it. Now we want to start the installation process. We'll go down and over, highlight install, click it. Now it's ready to open. We'll go down and over to open. As you can see, a roll of store ready to launch. So we'll just click open. Now you see it says welcome. So we're going to go all the way down so we can highlight next and we'll click next. Now, where it says account, please log in to continue. You got your two options, you got Google and anonymous. Um, it's best and it's safe to uh, click on anonymous. Um, you click on Google, you do not want to get blacklisted, meaning kicked out of your account for using this. So please select anonymous. So we'll just go over one and click on anonymous. 
And you see it says logging in. And it says successfully logged in. So you will be able to, to successfully log in with anonymous accounts. And as you can see, your category top apps, you got your top games, and you got your top family apps. So we want to click on, on more on the top app and just see what um, type of app that they have. So once we click on it, now, this is where your mouse toggle come in. You want to click the play pause button twice. So we click the play pause button twice. And as you can see, the mouse toggle comes up. And you can use, you use the mouse toggle to click on any one of the apps. Now, to scroll up and down, to scroll up, you want to use the fast forward button. And scroll down, we use the button with the three lines. Again, to scroll down, we want to use the fast forward button on our remote. And that will let us scroll down. And you can scroll down and look at as many apps as you would like. The three lines, you scroll up. And once you scroll up, and we're just going to click on one. I'm not going to install anything, but we're just going to click on one. Once you find the one that you want to install on your file stick, we just move that mouse toggle over. And I'm just gonna I'm just gonna click on Showtime. And so once we have that mouse toggle on Showtime, we click it. As you can see, it brings up the app. Now we want to use the three lines to go up. And once we go up, we see where it says install. We want to put that mouse toggle on install. And once you click install, you'll be able to install the application. Now that's how you use the mouse toggle, and that's how you install the application that you want. We want to go use the back button, go back. We want to go back. And we want to, I want to um, use the mouse toggle again, because sometimes it's hard to see where you're at without that mouse toggle. So we're going to click on more on the top game on the top games. So make sure we put that mouse toggle on more. We want to click on it. And it's the same. You got some of your top games, Pac-Man, Crossy Road, Into the Dead. Now, once again, to move down, you click the fast forward button on your remote. And we can just see all the games they have. Badland, you got Worm Zone, you got um, Bowling, Hungry Shark, Super Retro, you got Dead Trigger 2. And these are some of the games. You got Solitaire, you got you know, the great card game. And these are some of the um, apps that you have up on the top games. And once again, if you want to Install one, we'll just click on one, Magic Rampage, and once you click on it, remember the three lines is up, the fast forward button is for it to scroll down. So we'll click on the three lines and go up, and what we'll do, we'll put that mouse toggle on install, and this is where you install the application, as simple as that. So let's back out, back out again. And now we want to put that mouse toggle back in there. Hit your fast forward, your play pause button, and your um your mouse toggle come back up. Now sometimes you need to hit a couple more times because uh, most of the time when it comes the first time, but sometimes you need to hit it, you know, two or three times. That's just how it is. But for the most part, it's gonna come up that first time. So we'll just scroll down. You got top games. You got top apps. Now, we're back to this page where it says top apps. We look at top games. Let's go down. Let's look at top family apps. Now, I'm going to go ahead and put the mouse toggle back in because sometimes it's hard to see where you're at without the mouse toggle. So we'll click the um, play pause button twice. And as you can see, the mouse toggle comes back up. Now, upon the top family apps, we want to go and click on more. And this brings up all your top family apps. You still got your mouse toggle. We'll scroll down with the fast forward button. And we'll just look at different ones. Tune Google for TV. Um, you got Lego TV, Minnow Kids, you got Ocean Horn, these family apps. Um, you got Skater Kid, you got Voops, you got Baby uh, Adopter. And there's a lot of different family apps on here that you can just go down and choose from. We'll click on one, addition flash. We'll click the three lines and go up. And once again, you put your mouse toggle on install to install it. So we'll just go back to the home screen. 
And that's pretty much how you install the Google Play Store. And we're back on the home screen. What we want to do, we want to move these two apps to the front. So we'll go down once again up under your apps and channels. We'll go to see all and we'll click see all. Now let's move these two apps to the front so we will know where it's at on our file stick whenever we want to go to it. Well, let's just move it. We're just going to move the Aurora application. We don't have to uh, move the mouse toggle app on there up to the front. So let's go ahead and move both apps up to the front. So you see mouse toggle. We click the three lines on our remote. You had an option to move, move to front, and uninstall. We'll go ahead and move to the front. As you can see, it moved to the front. Now let's move the Aurora application to the front so we will know where that will be also. So we'll go down. We'll highlight Aurora. We'll click the three lines on our remote. We have the same option, move, move to the front, or uninstall. We'll click move to the front. We want to click on it. Now once we move, get through moving the app that we want to move to the front, we'll click the home button. And we'll go up on our, uh, your apps and channels. As you can see, the Aurora application and the mouse toggle is the first two apps on the your apps and channel. And that way, um, that, it'll be you there always whenever you turn on your fire stick. That's the end of the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the link below. I hope to see you on the next video. Have a great day. God bless.